good morning, everyone. I got an amazing, like, two hours of sleep, maybe, if I'm lucky. Maybe. Um, yeah, I'm tired. Kind of be expected, though, but, uh, I guess the big upside to this is when I get off at 11 a.m. in the morning, I'm going directly home. Actually, I get gas first. I hope I make it to work. That would be cool. And I am passing the F out. And, uh, I guess depending on how long I'm passed out, uh, me and, uh, Kim are gonna hang out later. So, uh, I don't know, hopefully sooner than later, but I gotta pass out, I gotta get to sleep. Uh, anyways, you guys gotta, you gotta do it. Vlog, vlog me to work, I need the energy to make it because I'm drained right now. So. Uh, Hey guys, I just got off work and uh, surprisingly I'm not that tired now, but I know as soon as I get home I'm going to be like, eh, I'm going to die probably. Ugh, if I catch one more light. Anyways, uh, I found something really strange. Um, I stopped, and I stopped at the BP, yeah, whatever, ridicule me all you want, I stopped at a BP. It was the cheapest gas, and it was there, and I literally had like 20 miles to eat, so. <clears throat> but no, I, I can't tell if this is cool or not cool. Um, they had a camera, or not a camera, uh, a, a TV playing the late night show with like uh, fun facts during the commercials at the uh, gas station where you pump at, like right where you pump. And um, I did learn a, a cool fact from it, I guess, but it's kind of weird. It's like TV at a gas station at the pump. Maybe they're doing it because, you know, their big BP oil spill. I don't, I don't know. But yeah, I thought it was interesting. Anyway, the fun fact that, that was on there was... Um, you know how when you pull a band-aid off and you like you're like one two three rip and then it hurts because it's you know it stings when the it pulls the hair. I said if you soak it in vodka and I don't know if this is true or not, but this is what they said. Unless BP's lying to more of the customers, uh, <laughs> you soak it in vodka and it takes the sting away. Don't know how anybody would have figured that one out, but uh, I guess it's worth a try. So somebody do it and let me know. <laughs> that was a bit of a fail. <laughs> Oh, oh, hey, we just like time warped out of my bed sleeping to a uh, Congo River Golf. And that was a bad fail. <laughs> no, <it's> not happy. <laughs> no, do you like a uh, happy Gilmore? Happy Gilmore, yeah. <laughs> right in, right in. Oh. <laughs> Wow, wow, wow. Oh yeah. <laughs> Could be like four or five for me. <laughs> oh! <laughs> goes in the drink. I just got that one. Woohoo! Well, well, we'll let you have a mulligan on that one. Just start right there. Yeah. Alright, you can go back if you want. Hey! I like turtles. You've never seen that, have you? The video? Oh, I'll show you later. Oh, by the way, I, I pointed that out to her. I was like, hey, look, it's a turtle. And she goes, is it real? Yes, it's real. <laughs> I wear glasses. Good luck. Her ball is all, hey, her ball is squeaky clean now. That's what she said. Hey, um, I, I have a question for you. I don't see my ball out here. And I know I just hit it from up there where we start at. Do you know where it's at? She's full of shit. <laughs>
hole in one that I didn't get on camera. That's a fail. It's just as good as a fail. Uh. Ah. Go, keep going. You can do it. Here. On the floor in hockey games, so I get <laughs> there. Yeah, that's true. Holy hell, that was a hell of a shot. Like the first shot I've made tonight. Maybe I should keep the camera on. I did it on purpose, I just wanted to extend the vlog a bit. <laughs> okay, good time to turn, right? Or wait, no. Four. <laughs> Alright. It's gonna fall. Like that. <laughs> break it. It's okay. Just wanna throw that out there. <laughs> I just gotta watch out for my nuts. <laughs> Drop the camera in there. Oh, oops, it's gone. So you're tallying up to see who the winner is here? It's gonna be close. Somebody get a hold of one. Verdict? You win. <laughs> it was closer than I looked on the scorecard then. Yeah. We're both uh, over par though. Yeah, so. we fucking suck. <laughs> Epic fail. Uh, it's, you know, two years removed from the course, so you gotta yeah. cut me some slack. <laughs> it's been quite some time for me too. We found and all the stuff. for five years. Yeah. They don't have pup pet Hey, we found all the stuff though. Yeah. yeah go us. Fucking champions. What's up guys? Um, me and Kim just got done watching um, The Love Guru. It's a, it's a Mike Myers movie and it, the premise is it's not hockey but it has hockey in it and they're trying to make the Toronto Maple Leafs win the Stanley Cup so it's a, it's like it's Mike Myers comedy you know Austin Powers slapstick just you know dumb comedy you just gotta you gotta be in like a if if you're in like a laughing gas mood like you know if I said like corn dog and you start laughing you watch it you would enjoy it but you gotta be in the mood to you know watch that kind of movie so if you are or, you know if you are check it out oh Texas one cool um, anyway but yeah it's called uh, the Love Guru Mike Myers and and actually it was funny um I, I don't know if you guys watch Tosh Point oh, but um, Daniel Tosh was actually in the movie, and I didn't realize it, you know, watching his show now, Tosh.0, I didn't realize it until now, but he was in the movie. So, um, yeah, you know, if you want to go check it out, it's a pretty good movie, I think. Uh, it's The Love Guru with Mike Myers, and, um, yeah, basically, if you have seen it, I uh, will say, um, 
if you remember, he was in the bar fight, and he was one of the guys that they first picked the fight with, and they ended up like you know, shaking in hands and hugging with outside. He was the guy with well, they they had a title at the end as a cowboy hat, Daniel Tosh. So I thought that was interesting, but um, yeah, she left already. Otherwise, I would put the camera on her. But you know, um, gotta be up in a couple hours for work, so do that. Come back home, get a nap. And uh, Thursday, lightning hockey. Saturday, I'll be hanging out with uh, Kim again. And then Sunday, Sunday is lightning hockey. I'm probably going to only see like, the first period of the game. I'm going, but I'm going to only see the first period because they're giving a nice free giveaway. It's a free uh, Bacaglia t shirt. So if you don't have tickets, get tickets and go. It's a very nice t shirt. I saw it. They advertised it at the last game. So definitely hit that up if you can. It's at 6 o'clock. 6 o'clock start time on Sunday. And um, seven seven thirty on Thursday for the Islanders. Anyways, I'm trying to not blab as much, but um, yeah, seven thirty on Thursday against the Islanders, six o'clock on Sunday uh, against the Nashville Predators. Dan Ellis's old team. Dan Ellis will probably play. So um, yeah, you know, get there early, get your free Vinny T-shirt, really cool T-shirt, and. Um, I'm only going to be there for the first period because I play hockey at like 8.15, so first period, maybe a little bit of the second. It all depends on how quick the game moves, so anyways, um, yeah, I need to get to sleep, so I will see you guys tomorrow morning when I get home. How about that? All right, good night, guys.